Josh with Dr. Tom and Guitar Picks with Will Little. Frank Zappa, you are what you is. You are what you is. Um, Frank Zappa is a big influence. Um, it's just amazing the compositions that he came up with, the people that he played with and the sound that he got. Um, and the fact that he had the courage to say some of the some of the political statements that he said in his music, both in his music and just outright in interviews and things like that. You know, he just kind of had a throw caution to the wind attitude about everything, and he was very serious about what he believed in and, and you know, the sound that he produced, from what I understand. Mm -hmm. You know, he was very strict with his band about rehearsal and, you know, substance abuse and things like that. Those were all strictly taboo with him, and mm -hmm. they were very serious, serious musicians who, who cranked out a lot of phenomenal music that I, you know, haven't even been able to wrap my head around. Um, mm -hmm. This is one of the, it's a real fun song. It's kind of got some some crazy lyrics going on and it's got a good up tempo disco feel so it's it's got a lot of it's a little bit more accessible than some of the real crazy out there esoteric Frank Zappa stuff so <laughs> that's why I chose that as an influence for maybe some people that haven't heard Frank Zappa before so you didn't choose uh, Planet of the Baritone Women no <laughs> you know another real good album of his um, is called Waka Jawaka and I think there's only four tracks and they're real long, um, mostly instrumental, and that was probably the first Zappa album I got, but, mm -hmm. you know, wanting to include a little bit of everything, such as, you know, his political commentary and, and off-the-wall lyrics and things like that, that's why I chose You Are What You Is. Yeah. 